A strange humming in the night, a sort of low droning noise like a diesel engine that no one else can hear. It sounds like something out of a sci-fi movie. But many of Auckland's North Shore residents claim that's what they've had to put up with for years. And now scientists at Massey University are undertaking a major project to try to identify the mystery noise. <laughs> The noises that can drive you mad, but in houses all over Auckland's North Shore, there's another noise driving residents to distraction. When it's loud, when it's, it's like there's vibrations happening between your ears and your brain is just vibrating. It is just, and you can't concentrate on anything. The thing about this painful, debilitating hum is most of us can't hear it. But researchers at Massey University are convinced it exists. Dozens of people who can hear it have contacted them. It's like a propellered airplane in the distance. They've discovered the noise hits the scales at a frequency of around 56 hertz and probably at a very low volume, which only some with particularly sensitive hearing can pick up. And while these researchers don't have sensitive enough equipment to measure the noise yet, an electronics engineer who can hear it has come up with this simulation. <laughs> Imagine living with that every day, because that's what Marie Peds had to put up with for three years. It can be that loud that I, if my husband is down the other end of the, the room there, I can't hear him. The aim of researchers now is to measure the hum, but what do they think causes it? There are going to be cases where the sewage pump nearby or the factory nearby is causing a problem, but I think this is, this is a little bit deeper than that. This is a slightly different uh, problem altogether. And of course, theories abound. Instances of humming have been documented before both in New Zealand and overseas. So could it be electromagnetic forces, earthquakes or vibrations from submarines? Or could it be something altogether more mysterious? Feel a little bit like you're sort of entering the twilight zone? Actually we do, at the moment myself and my colleague, I do feel occasionally that it's trying to chase shadows. Shadows that those who can hear the hum hope can be caught soon. Pippa Wetzel, one...